Good morning, my name is Amelia, and today we are going to be singing for our first song. We are going to be singing, we welcome, we come now to your table, Lord. It, it, the country it is from is from Jamaica, and the language is English. Thank you. Good morning, everybody. Good to see you all. Welcome. This is our Music Camp Sunday of 2023, Joyful Noise. We're here to share some joyful noise with all of you this morning and our wonderful youth choir, Joyful Noise, right here with us this morning. Let's give it up for them one more time. We're going to continue our worship with this time of repentance. And I'm going to ask you to read along with me in your bulletins on the opening page. Let us pray. God, our Father, we have become out of tune with your will. Your melody of truth and righteousness has become muddled, and we can't find our way back without your help. Forgive us for all the wrong we have committed in thought, word, and deed. Send your spirit upon us to return us to the right frequency of light and love so that we may follow after the teachings and example of Jesus Christ in all that we do. Thank you for your grace and mercy. In Jesus' name, amen. Good morning, my name is Natalia, and today we are going to be singing a song called It Is Raining from the country of Liberia in the language of English. It is So we are 
are filled until we are filled with the lot of Now please join with me in your bulletins with Psalm 100. It will be read responsively. Shout with joy to the Lord all the earth. Acknowledge that the Lord is God. He made us and we are his. We are his people, the sheep of his pasture. Enter his gates with thanksgiving. Go into his courts with praise. Give thanks and pray to him and praise his name. For the Lord is good. His unfailing love continues forever and his faithfulness continues to each generation. Word of God, word of life. Thanks be to God. Good morning, my name is Yaretsi Barrera. Uh, the next song is Alleluia, Jean Urua. Alleluia, praise the God. The language, uh, the country is Nigeria, and the language is Yoruba and English. Thank you. Our next reading is from Ephesians 5, and starting with verse 18. Be filled with the Holy Spirit, singing psalms and hymns and spiritual songs among yourselves, and making music to the Lord in your hearts, and give thanks for everything to God the Father in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Word of God, word of life. Thanks be to God. God's grace, peace, and faith and spiritual melody and harmony be unto you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. The first thing that I noticed from this reading in Ephesians, you guys might want to, you can go sit down just for a little bit. Okay, thank you. <laughs> Don't worry, this won't take too long. It won't take too long. 
Um, the first thing I noticed is it talks about all kinds of different music. It talks about the, the well-known Old Testament songs of praise to God, played mostly with the harp, but really with all kinds of different instruments. It talks about the hymns that the early church used, uh, the ones that they sang to learn about the doctrine, to learn the creed, to learn about what they had been taught by Jesus and to gather together. It even talks about spontaneous music, somebody getting up and just coming up with a song on the spot in order to give a message to the people. And literally, those words where it says, make music in verse, in verse 20, it literally means make melody, make a melody, to create a melody in our singing to God. Melodies are really catchy, right? That's what we might remember after years and years and years of not hearing a song. 20 years, 30 years, 40 years later, we can still remember the melodies to our favorite songs. We can still remember the melodies to our favorite hymns that we sang in church when we were young. It sticks with us over the years. I noticed this when I'm visiting members of our church that have Alzheimer's or dementia, is one of the last things that they always remember are the hymns that they grew up singing in church. Uh, I visited one of our members and we put some music on and she wasn't responding to anything else, but she started humming along when she heard How Great Thou Art. She started humming along with the melody of that song. It sticks with us. It's, it's deeper, it's deep as our bones. It's just ingrained in who we are, the music that we sing, the melodies that we make, and especially what we make to God, those melodies and music that we make to God. There's just something special about music. I personally, as I've gotten a little older, you may know, hip hop has always been my favorite type of music, but as I've gotten a little older, I've really come to appreciate all different kinds of music. I love every single type of music, except maybe heavy metal rock. I don't know why, but I can't, I can't get into it as much. I try though, I try, and there are some songs. There are some songs that I do like, but it's just, appropriate, I think, that we sing all of these beautiful songs here together in church, coming from all these different countries, coming from all these different cultures and backgrounds and languages and styles of music. There's some that have the, the Western notation to them. There's some that you just have to learn by listening. You just learn it by ear. Uh, there's all different type of music that we sing I think it's very appropriate that we come together in church and we can appreciate one another's styles of music, from the hymns that I grew up with as a little kid, all the way to, hopefully, the hip hop that we do here in church now, occasionally, occasionally, not too much, a little bit of hip hop for you. It doesn't hurt, it helps us appreciate one another. I mean, Paul used pretty much any word he could think of to describe the type of music that they were supposed to sing together in order to get his point across. He used the word for songs. He used the word for hymns. He used the word for odes. He talked about spiritual songs, spontaneous songs. He even talked about lyrical poems set to music. Maybe there was a precursor to hip hop going on in the early church there. You never know, you never know. I don't know, what kind of music do you guys like? What type of music do you like to sing in church? Shout it out, let me know. What do you like to sing? In, all right, rock and roll, yes. We do a little bit of rock and roll in church and outside of church. What else, what kind of music? What's your, what's your, the, your favorite music to sing in church? Country, oh, we're gonna have a little bit of country music a little later, just a little bit. A little country flavor for you. 80s music, like uh, pop 80s. I don't know if we have that today, but we'll work on it. We'll work on it, pop 80s. Ooh, folk rock. All right, now we're getting into niche, niche genres over here, folk rock in particular. How about you kids over here? What's your favorite type of music to sing in church? Smooth jazz, all right, I like that, I like that. 
Wait, we gotta get Chris back and get some smooth jazz going on here. What about the rest of you? What do you like to hear? Hmm? K-pop. All right, I, that would be a new one. I wonder, if maybe in the, the Good Village Church, they might have some K-pop. Probably not, but we can recommend it to them. We can recommend it. Anything else? You guys like to sing in church? Anybody else? What about Greg? West Texas Country Swing. West Texas Country Swing. All right. Uh, you want to play some for us? You got any West Texas? Oh, later. Okay. Maybe for the outro. For the outro. <laughs> what about Dan over here? Whatever. Greg Whatever. Well, follow Greg. Follow Greg. You may like traditional hymns. You guys, lo I love some traditional hymns. Some some uh, blessed assurance. Ooh, Dixieland jazz when the saints go marching in. You can have some of that going on. All this beautiful, beautiful music. We can come together. We can appreciate one another. We can sing together. We can make amazing music and melodies and joyful noise for our God. Music, I think, really comes from the heart. Music touches our hearts and souls. And for many of us, music is a form of prayer. It's a form of prayer that we give to God, this offering that we give to God in our music. And in both of our readings this morning, it talks about giving thanks to God. The psalm even says, shout for joy to come into God's temple and worship with gladness. For God is good and his love is never ending. Can we do a little shout for God over here? Can you guys shout for God? Let me hear you on the count of three. Say, Alleluia! One, two, three. Alleluia! Ooh, they're good. They're good. How about you guys out here? You think you can match their energy? On the count of three. One, two, three. Say, Alleluia! One, two, three. Alleluia! What do you think? Did they match your energy? I don't think so. I think the kids are showing you all up out here. Can we try that? How about you come out here and show them how to do it? Come, come get in your spot. Let's show them how to do it. They know all about joyful noise. They know what's up. All right, so they're going to help you guys out on the count of three. We got to shout hallelujah, okay? You guys ready? One, two, three. Hallelujah! Ouch. Ouchie. How about you guys over here? Can you match that? On the count of three, say hallelujah. One, two, three. All right, we're getting better, we're getting better. Hallelujah. Thanks be to God. Let's make some joyful noise. Amen, amen. Good morning, my name is Brayden. The song we will be singing is Weenie, Weenie Mambu. Um, the country is from Papa New Guinea. And the language is talk, be, sing, and English. Thank you.
the Apostles' Creed. Please join in reciting it. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth. I believe in Jesus Christ, God's only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the power of the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended to the dead. On the third day, he rose again. He ascended into heaven. He is seated at the right hand of the Father, and he will come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and the life everlasting. Amen. Let us pray. God, we pray for all people across the world in our communities and families who are in need of love and healing. We ask that you be with all those who are in our hearts and minds, bringing them comfort. We pray for all people around the world who suffer in any way from economic loss, family loss, from wars, famines, and other natural disasters, and anything that brings pain. Transform us together that we may seek the well-being of all people and indeed all of creation. God of all creatures, creation, we thank you today for your gift of musicians. We know that every good and perfect gift comes from you. We thank you for the custodians of the music of the divine service. We thank you for string instruments, wind instruments, percussion, and singers. This holy week, Lord God, we ask that you bless all who guide us through the ministry of music worship. May musicians facilitate music that brings you glory, music that transcends barriers that divide race, class, gender, denominationalism, ethnicity, or geography. May their gifts create the atmosphere that lifts you up. For you said, if you be lifted up from the earth, you will draw all people unto you. Today, we celebrate musicians for the healers that they are, providing light and renewal to their soul. Lord God, gracious and merciful, we pray for your strength and the strength of their families, for their strength and the strength of their families and loved ones. We ask that you continue to cause them to create and share the gift of music through instrument and voice. May they find joy in their work and may it fill them with peace, comfort, and purpose. Fill musicians with your light and love as they generously share with the world. Lord, let all creation sing your praise and the host make music in your presence. Bless musicians as only you can. Thank you for the gift of music today that our songs will rise up to you like offerings and incense. Open our hearts and minds to the power of music to bring praise to you, to teach us new things, to inspire us, and to unite us together in Christ and in your spirit. Thank you for this young group of singers and musicians in our church. We ask that you would continue to bless their talent and their ministry, and they give glory to you. Amen. 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 And may the peace of Christ be with you all. Let's share a sign of that peace with one another.
called Joyful Noirs, illustrated by Pastor Nate. Thank you so much to our singers here. We do have some quick announcements for you this morning um, before we sing our last song together here. And uh, we have a meeting after this service with our president, Tom Pankow, talking about the state of the congregation. So please, right after church, head on over to the fellowship hall where we'll be gathering together for that meeting with Tom. And make sure you come and join us as we talk together about our past, present, and future of our congregation. I also uh, heard news of the passing of uh, Janice Noren, um, who was the uh, wife of Pastor Noren, who served as an interim pastor here. And um, there will be more information coming out about that. The Synod sent some information out, um, but we will get that to you as well. Um, about a time for a service for her. I believe it's going to be in Covina. So please be on the lookout for more information and keep her family in your thoughts and prayers during this difficult time. And coming up on the 20th of August, in lieu of our um, potluck on the third Sunday of the month, we're actually going to be going down to the beach. So we're going to be having a bonfire at the beach right after church. We're going to be heading over there. Um, so that is August 20th. Everybody's invited. 
Make sure you put that down on your calendar right after church. We're going to be heading over. And then uh, we're going to be finishing out our time during the summer. And then when we get to September, it is going to be Rally Sunday and all kinds of stuff coming up. Rally Sunday is on September 10th, along with our Congregational Appreciation Day. Uh, so make sure you put that on your calendar to come and join us. And I want to open up if there's any other announcements that you'd like to share with us this morning. Anything I'm forgetting? I think this is a first. All right. No more announcements. Well, I do want to say thank you so much to Domaris and to Greg, who were our leaders during our music camp this week. Um, we, we didn't have Chris with us, but they were able to help guide us through this week. So thank you so much to them being our leaders uh, and for this week. And I want to thank Linda for coming in and playing piano for us. And Dan as well, of course, on the guitar. Thank you so much. And I want to thank all these youth who are up here right now. Let's give it up for them. They put a lot of effort into this. Oh, and thank you so much to Lydia, who provided lunch for everybody all week long, and Stephanie as well, who helped out with that. Thank you so much for your support and for all of your support of our ministries here at St. Paul Lutheran Church. All right, you guys ready for our last song? All right, we're going to sing our last song. I think you guys should all stand up for this. You may have heard this song before. So as we get into it... Um, then you're going to start singing along with us, okay? Hello, my name is Yaretsi Allen. Today we'll be singing a song called Make a Difference. Uh, the country is United States and the language is English. You gave your life to make a difference you gave your life to make a change you welcomed us to
let's go make a difference. We are the citizens with the same citizens. Distance and divisions been killed. Past hostility and history. One body bringing unity. New humanity, family's reality. We used to be distant, but now we're all together and we're making a difference. Walk alongside you, I don't want to fight you. Christ is our peace, our prophet like Elijah. Savior that will save you, you're no longer strangers. We have been afraid, but now we're all neighbors. Walls fall like, oh, when the cornerstone is Christ. Our peace and the giver of life. Hold us together and guide us tonight. Show us how you want us to serve, how you want us to listen with you. We'll be making a difference. Go in peace, singing joyful praise to God. Thanks be to God. Alleluia. Alleluia.